we'll start talking about as you created some dowels, you'll want to start um, thinking about connecting, okay? So Master Builder 2 here, L, will show us how to create some 2D, two-dimensional shapes, okay? Shapes on a plane, okay? Will you model that for us? <laughs> yeah, so go ahead and make me, make me some of your edges, some of your angles, okay? Okay. Okay, so why don't you make me a triangle, okay? But first, just make me an angle, okay? Yeah, make me the, your, okay? And we'll get you the tape for you. So watch closely to see what Elle's doing here, okay? And you can even pull a little bit further so those in the audience can see, okay? Okay, so notice what Elle did right here, how Elle taped it, latched one over the other, and then taped it down, okay? And then Elle's gonna do the same thing to the other side. And even the process of this build, um, you know, a lot of developing geometric reasoning is really having conversations. So while Elle's drawing, I might even say, Elle, Elle, can you tell me, like, notice this shape, notice this angle right here, okay? And I know in third grade, we start talking, third and fourth grade, we start talking yeah. about angles, okay? What kind of angle is this? What do we um, call that? An acute. An acute angle. What makes an acute angle? Um, because it's less than 90 degrees. Okay. And then... How about if I, can you show me what a, a nine degree angle might look like? It's a right angle. It's a right angle. And this is a good time now to also, an important part of um, geometry is starting to appreciate how um, geometry and geometry concepts are all around our world. In art, in architecture, um, even engaging in some geometry walks. So Al, can you think about something in our household that has a right angle? Um, pillows? Our pillows have right angles?